forgot to change the name. Okay, I really am just going to change the names after each stream, in, so I don't forget it the next day. And, okay, apparently... Need this again. Hello anyone in here watching now, later on on YouTube, uh, Alien here, along with, uh, here. and, yeah, welcome to Something Sunday, the, num the 29th, I think, and, uh, yeah, I forgot to change the title again, so I just quickly rushed to change that, so, yeah, I guess all the games will be a, a, a surprise for anyone watching. But first off, we're starting with Mr. Shifty here. I've, I've seen a little bit about this game. This game looks a, is, it plays a bit like a, it, it said an advice controller, so why is it talking about keyboard and mouse now? It's sort of similar to Hotline Miami in a way, but different than others, as you'll get to see in just a bit, I think. That's a lot of guys. <laughs> okay. Oh, I think I, I recognize this. Yeah, we have a short range teleport like this. Alright, then I've seen a little bit of this game on YouTube. I forgot by who we lost, but yeah, second guy was on my level. Could be. Oh, stick. That's even a lot of tricky Kanye. Uh, you know, mm -hmm. it's what it for some audio videos or some interesting came up and yeah, basically I forgot about this. Oh I'm pretty sure we die in one hit, so let's not get hit at all. Oh dear. Okay. So I can use the controller like this, but yeah, mouse and key is going to be more accurate. And that all hostiles. Okay, hello there. That's more like it. Bye -bye. Oh, you do have help. Oh, give me a moment to squat a bot. There we go, get fucked. 
Um, oh yeah, we have five uh, hits deep we can take, it seems. That's kind of merciful, though. that would remove some frustration. Yeah, because yeah, Hotline Miami can get quite frustrating. So it seems you regenerate your health quite quickly, if that is now health. Yeah, the, the top bar is a sort of combo breaker, I think. No? Yeah, we're talking about the squares on the hill. Knock, knock. Ooh. Achievement surprise. Ow! Knock, knock. Girl Scouts. I guess that's a limit to how. Like, you can take one shot and stuff, but if you take too many too fast, you die. Yeah, I, I think these five bars might be the health, not the one above. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Mm. But I keep saying if you lose in one, then it doesn't take long for it to regenerate. Or, actually, no. That's our jumps. Okay, so. Oh, okay. Pick up. How screaming? <laughs> yeah. uh, I have no idea what that was just there. <laughs> okay, so we can't just take... Well, we can't take one hit. <laughs> So it will be tricky then. See, one broke. Uh, what's this? The fun mug. Let's take the pole instead. Okay, I'm guessing that is a one time thing. Okay, we just throw that. I think it might be a. Just a one-shot thing where you can dodge a bullet that would have hit you otherwise, I'm thinking. It may explain it later. It would be very helpful so one knows what one can do and should definitely not do. Oh, well, never mind. <laughs> he still got shot there. Hmm. You can sort of aim the, the launching of doors. Okay, this is a fun little game. Is that all of them? Ow! <laughs> okay, we jumped right into that one. Hacking progress. Okay, just uh, toot your own horn. So much for genius. <laughs> Hello. Goodbye. I should not jump directly towards guys. At least not when they're aiming at me already. Come get some. <laughs> or I should just jump it. Statue arm. Okay. Give me. <laughs> Wait, did we? 
Did we accidentally block a bullet there, or did, it, oh, did our weapon get stuck in the doorway? I think weapon got stuck in the doorway. They're probably... Oh. They're probably... Oh, I think that's... That slow-mo is from us filling the, ba the bar, I think. There we go. That would have been quite difficult with the controller. So yeah, I'm sticking to... <laughs> I'm sticking to the mouse and key. Oh dear. <laughs> okay, Shifty, here's the situation. This is Olympus Tower, the most secure building in the world. The tower belongs to Chairman Stone. See, 6 foot 4 to 20. Stoneman, Stone Eye, Corruption, Illegal Weapons, Attack, Drug Trafficking. He's an evil asshole. <laughs> he's one for which <laughs> criminal offenses, but he's not why we're here. This is Mega Plutonium. Chairman Asshole stole some, he's trying to weaponize it. We can't let that happen. Break in, secure the Mega Plutonium, then get the hell out of there. Yeah. Tongue firmly in cheek with this game, it seems. <laughs> okay, access. One level up, okay. The elevator can't win. <laughs> That's supposed to mean. Okay. Oh, hello, lasers. Nothing around here. At least it's not sharks with lasers. <laughs> yeah, Dr. Evil will have to wait a little bit more. Ow. Okay, so we'll just have to quick jump through there. Oh, come on! Did you not stop your toe into that? Yep. <laughs> okay, keep a bit more distance this time. There we go. And has that... That's turned him off, okay. I feel like there's something in my eye. Oh, that sounds like combat music. Oh, <laughs> that's a bit much. Yeah, you think? <laughs> oh! <laughs> well, they weren't expecting that, so I guess you could call us the Spanish Inquisition. Damn it! I'm not planning to do that, you. Oh, I was I was expecting an achievement for that for causing friendly fire. Is the game just? I think the game just crashed. Yeah, oh, the game on. crashed. Well, that's a mark against it. Okay. So what's for PC? No, nothing, none of the stats over here on the task manager spiked, so yeah, it just crashed on its own. Okay. Yeah. No. How old is that game now? It's not too old, actually. I think it's from the 10s. Oh. At least it yeah. starts up quick enough and these missions are short enough. Oh, yeah, unless, of course, they put us back here. Okay. Where, uh, screen share, please. Yeah, give me a sec. There. Okay, that, this is a half mark against it again then. That it starts us at the start of this and not in a yeah, checkpoint in the middle. 
the list we if, know... it, if it crashes again, then it's off the list. Yeah. Okay, if we use all five charges, it takes a bit to uh, for them to start refilling again. It takes longer. Okay, bye bye. I'm guessing all of these guys must dye their hair because they can't all be blonde. That or it's hot. I'll tell you this, Erwin is hair. Yeah, I guess, why would a security officer wear a yellow hat? What the? Is that James Bond? Mm. No, mind. The way he was speaking, the way he had a tuxedo. Okay, those would have been a lot harder without the table lag, I think, or whatever it was we had. Oh. Yeah, I think you ripped off one of their arms. And... Ow. No, it, it was from a... This is from a table we destroyed in the previous bit. So, not, uh, I mean, like, one of them flew off, it looked like he was missing an arm. Oh, I almost got hit there. There we go. Okay, we'll have to be careful about those guys. Yeah. Oh, my food's done. It's not going to it. So don't die. Oh, no, it's, a, it's a freaking paddle. What the hell is that doing in a building like this? Oh well. Let me give these guys a good paddling. Oh, I see now. <laughs> Stuff them all into a corner. If this bar is filled up, it allows us to uh, get a second chance like that. Bit texture lining there, I think. This has crap written all over it. Hello. Thank you. I'm not much of a trap. Uh, okay, we can <laughs> we can we can use a keyboard as a weapon. I'm back. Uh. Are you really not reaching? No. Nope. But uh, I guess for just a moment there, we you could call us an, a true nope, prop crap keyboard warrior. Oh dear. I don't think keyboards make good weapons unless they're like my keyboard that is made of a lot of metal. Yeah. Okay, keep running, keep running. Mine is not a massive one, but yeah. There's some solid metal in this one, and quite weight to it. So if I were to throw, slam it with one hand, it's gonna hurt a lot. I don't want to. Well, so I, I, I figured out work. that uh, the bar, the upper bar, if we fill that up, we get a second chance if we were to have gotten hit. I think. Okay, but that would sort of make sense. Uh, I'm surprised that they gave us a tutorial. It's more it's more of a show don't tell. Okay. Oh. Ow. <laughs> he smashed this guy's head into a freaking lamp. Bye bye. You were thought you were smart, huh? Uh did he says it's how to use your own trick? Yep. And here I thought it was like, oh you forgot to turn it off. Okay. Hmm. 
It'll probably be best if we use this on the big boys first. Oh, I almost missed you. My aim's getting better. Okay. <laughs> Okay. OBS yes, up top again. Yeah, I guess you could call us the cleanup crew with the broom. Oh dear. Hi. Okay. Can you upload it? Two enemies on this floor. Expect heavy resistance. Heavier than we already had. Oh. Okay, heavy caliber resistance. Wait. Are those sharks? They very well might be. Oh wait. No, the thing is wrong. Let me take that. Like that's, that's something else. Why are there paddles all over this freaking place? That's like sailing. Oh no! Don't tell me how to do something worse than sharks. Dude, it, it looks too small to be orcas. The hell did that, why the hell did that break? And uh, hello, Ever Sony. Uh, to, 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 I think of last. Uh, it, I, I missed a bunch of it because things were a bit busy. But things seem to be going um, reasonably okay. Oh, oh, that is going to be... Actually, that's not going to be a problem. Or maybe... Okay. Ow. <laughs> okay. Let's see. Is there a way for me to break that glass? Or... That's it. Okay, th this is a bit of a... Bit of an extra tutorial showing that glass will stop lasers. Okay, break dancing in the air. Oh! Let's see. Uh, Abby again, what's an enjoyable game to watch for the viewer's sake? Uh, yeah. yeah, again, I had wasn't watching full the, all the time. Okay, they are really quick on the draw. <laughs> wait, wait, what are they asking about? Uh, a stream with Beanie lost uh, yesterday. Ah! I'm missing uh, all these streams of late. Okay. And. Yeah. <laughs> uh, he's talking about uh, Grim Dawn that they were playing yesterday. And ah. also to say, this is a nice one you're playing at the end. Yeah. Uh, it's, we still have uh, 20 minutes left on this, so it is 2015. Can I bait them into shooting that barrel? Wrong here, Helian. Wrong here. Oh, wait. 2015. That's not fucking a bit wrong. Well, we got through that with minimal <laughs> destruction. Minimal? Well, I guess most destruction was on them instead. Okay, this place is too empty. There's a trap. Okay, showing how you can destroy reactors, get over the fences. Lost. <laughs> Should be a cakewalk for a teleporting thief. And uh, yeah, I'm not sure if you've seen any of these something Sundays before, but basically we try a few games to see if they're good for streaming. And, uh, yeah, I'm, I'd, so far, except for one crash, this looks like a fun game. Oh, okay. Let's see. <laughs> they really have this thing booby-trapped up the ass. Yeah, and what the heck is that in the water? It's not charged, but it... Anything is wrong. 
Oh, hello. Statue head. And then... There we go. Okay. Showing us how we can destroy things at a distance. This place is going to be filled now. Can I just run past? No, I cannot. Okay, just leave it in there for a moment and... I did not expect to survive that. <laughs> oh, uh, hello, boys. Please hold a moment. Thank you for your patience. That's probably why that truck was there to begin with. Oh. Ah. <laughs> then I just get shot by a normal guy. Okay. Okay, one for one. <laughs> ah. Catch. Did I get them both with the same ball? Oh. Oh. Yeah, there, see, we, it was charged, and that would have hit us otherwise. So that, does, so that does give a second chance. Okay, playing a game of cats with someone who can teleport is kind of cheating. <laughs> <laughs> well, I think I agree with you. Come on, boys. <laughs> Catch. Uh, well, I go a fake. Okay. Okay, so they have the st real stuff hidden somewhere else. So it turns out it was a decoy. This is too dangerous. We should abort. I very much doubt that he's going to abort. You want to keep going, don't you? Terrible plan. <laughs> uh. What the heck? Yeah, th this game couldn't be any more 80s, 90s themed. <sighs> okay. It does seem that this game is probably pretty short. Defiance. Well, short if you're very good at these kinds of games. Okay, shifty stop directions and death is a go. We need to find a way they're keeping the real Mega Plutonium. The one that doesn't explode. Maybe the data terminal... Yeah, data terminal here in the Great Library. Find it. That's... That's it in this place? Okay. No guards at all. Oh. <laughs> that was stupid. I thought that was the guy I launched out the window. Uh, what are we gonna do with you? There we go, charged up again. Let's go. Yeah, see, that would have hit us. And let's just break this for that. Oh, look, can you take that with the pistols? No, you can't seem to. Oh, another guy. We're in purple. Oh, they have shotguns. But okay, your priority targets. Yeah, this game is very mo oh, shifty. I forgot to mention slow mo. It's not. I'm going to say this once. Attacking builds your orange slow mo meter. Attacking is good. If the slow mo meter is full. Slow mo auto activates when that bullet gets close. Okay, like we figured out ourselves. Uh, 
And that's how you clean a house. <laughs> okay, someone clip that. <laughs> I fully deserve that for getting cocky. Yeah, you did. <laughs> Sort of wasted, but okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, just gotta love ragdolls, don't you? Oh, hello, you're waiting for me? Okay. Look, knock, knock. Looks like one leather gunman style. Ow. <sighs> yeah, ragdolls in slow motion, that's always fun. Yep. Yeah, the hell, hello, Poseidon. And goodbye, Poseidon. Oh, <laughs> and hello again. Ow! <laughs> Did I spear that motherfucker? I, I totally would have speared that motherfucker to the wall if there was blood in this game. <sighs> You're coming with me. Yeah, bring, bring it. It feels like if, if you throw it right, you can impale several people. Like that? <laughs> uh, yeah, this game is a go. Ton of fun. Hello, boys. Yep. Yeah, I think we found our favorite weapon in this game so far. Just yeets him out of the fucking sight. <laughs> Gimme. Yep. <laughs> this entire level, this entire bit is just built around having fun with those. Well, oh, there it is. Did he just... <laughs> Did he just go underneath the table and now he's nailed? The freaking terminal. Ow! So our blueprints are incomplete. There must be hidden rooms and secret passages everywhere. I will look around. Can this thing actually break? It doesn't seem like this thing can break. I think that might be... Uh... Made of steel or something that has been gilded, as in gold covered. Yeah. Okay. If that had been pure gold, sure, sure, it would be hurt to impale by it since it's been so damn heavy. But it would, well, obviously, give a lot of death bending from all the throwing. Does it mean that there's a secret passage somewhere in this room? Or... Hmm. This is a trident. Hmm. Let's just try and hit every inch of this wall. Somewhere around here. Let's see, am I? Oh. The floor pattern. I think. There we go. Okay, for some reason the spear doesn't hurt. Okay. okay. Sarah isn't in the tower's blueprints. Okay. Neither is that conspicuously well guarded elevator. Okay, this thing just won't break. Okay. 
or they just needed a lot more punishment than that will do. Hello. Give me a moment, boys. Okay, yeah, this game is a lot of fun. It's really works. Oops. Achievement unlocks traitor. Okay. I'm guessing that is uh, the get, get the enemies to friendly fire themselves. <laughs> oh. Where's that trident? Yeah. Just to say, We're... don't forget the trident. We're keeping this thing for as long as we can. <laughs> Let's see. Getting a bit close to uh, the 30 minutes allotted to this game, and uh, oh, come on, it took our freaking trident. Oh. This suspicious room is sure is well protected. What's that? Oh. Okay. Oh, we can split. Okay. Splitting parts, or does it just lead to the same place? Okay, we can use that as a weapon. Oh, come on! Okay. And let's turn off half of them. So this way should end the other half. And okay, dope. Is that shark? Those are sharks! Why are they swimming <laughs> on their side? No, no, you are looking for them from above. Oh yeah, good. I'm being dumb. And that's why I reacted to the old, earlier ones. They reacted that those, the earlier ones we saw were not sharks. These are sharks. The other ones must have been some kind of whale or manatee. Okay, that was just pure luck of getting the, the correct hidden room. <laughs> okay, let's have a look in there. And let's see how far we'll get into this stage before we call it. And actually, I'm gonna look at the floor. This is a very Greek pattern. Yeah, it, the tower is called Olympus. Yeah. So that could be by the oh, hello stone. So you're the thief. What's your deal? But it's dead parents, it's always dead. <laughs> Kill him. <laughs> Oh, bunch of you big boys, huh? Give me that. And that. And that. Okay, just send a freaking legion against me. Okay, any more takers? Nope. Interesting. <laughs> okay, more takers. Okay. Oh. How many guys does this guy have in his employ? Bravo, thief. There was quite a display. Unfortunately, I can't let you live. Nobody kills my goons except me. <laughs> so this guy specifically has rooms built into his building for ambushing thieves. That's far enough. Lock down all exits. Hmm. 
we going to have to blow up a wall or something? Ooh, ooh. That... <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah, again, I should not jump directly towards enemies. Try them. Ow. Again, not towards, but I should jump diagonally. Capable of. Oh, you're a stone called Killer Stone. <laughs> and so are we. Oh, I think we're in the maintenance tunnels or something. Hello. Hey, I said lockdown. <laughs> okay, someone's uh, not getting paid. Uh, someone's not getting their life insurance either. Did I completely overlook this guy because I didn't see him? I think you did. Okay, let's finish up this stage. I have more goons, Steve. See? More goons. <laughs> Okay, there's the exit. And that's a bunch of guys. Nope. Ah, still got hit, okay. Yeah, yellow is machine gun, purple is shotgun. Oop. This game is fun. This is definitely on the list. Though if it's only this tower, then we'd probably finish it in a single stream. Hmm. Yeah, with how far we've gotten so far. Typically... Hmm. Yeah, I should probably add this on another Sunday just to finish it up, or... Hmm. I think it work for me. Otherwise it would have a its own Saturday or something, or own Sunday. Let's see, come work for me, see if it was full, full of things I want stolen or punched. <laughs> say the word and I'll spare you a messy, violent death. I don't think he can say the word, I think he's mute. But, <laughs> well, the objective failed. <laughs> come on! Okay. That's long enough on this one, but yeah, we're fin we're finishing that off in a dip in another stream. Maybe I'll stick it to the front of the next something Sunday, or mm, shall we switch Saturday uh, next week Saturday with this instead of Slime Rancher? Maybe I know I like Slime Rancher more. But mm. maybe an extra stream tomorrow. Yeah, we'll just finish that up. Okay. Anyways, then well, next well, stream. We just finish it next, uh, next Sunday. Mm. <clears throat> okay. Stream to do here. And. 
let's see. Yeah, this game had a bit uh, of yeah. annoyance. Let's see. Aim capture specific. And it should caps now. There we go. I can see. Uh, have you played this before? Nope. And that's what this uh, that's what this something Sunday is all about. Just trying out games <laughs> or showing them off. Oh, so, yeah, wow. Mutant Year Zero. This made quite a bit of a splash before it showed up, but after it launched, just nothing. So I don't know if it's good or bad. But again, that's what this is all about. I think people like it, though. Yes, it is a long game, I think. Let's see. I, I think it's an XCOM-like. So let's see, we have... It starts off on hard. Uh, so let's tr try normal. Iron Mutant, yeah, it Iron Mutant, Iron Man, that is very XCOM. Somewhere east of the Ark. Another day, another mission, risking our necks for the Ark. You know, I ask myself, Ducks, why are you out here? And you know why. The Ark's water pump is broken again, and Hammond said he needs more scrap to fix it. Yeah, well, we'd do it a lot better if he'd sent us somewhere with actual scrap to find. Why do you have to be so annoying? Come on, we gotta head back before Prep closes for the night. Okay, this isn't <laughs> XCOM at all. Yeah. It's do you recognize the environment? Shut the hell up. Nope. Wanna see annoying? I can show you annoying. Let's see, I can you zoom in on the signs? We're in the zone. Keep your eyes open and mouth shut. Yeah, you only told me that 9,000 times already, Borman. Tingberg and Knop Larp or Tarp? Tingberg or Knop Larp. Okay, so yeah. this is the Swedish game you were talking about. <laughs> yes, welcome to Sweden! <laughs> and uh, yeah, welcome to Humanity Dead. One corpse is not really a sign of humanity being extinct. Let's see, cute to hold. I don't know if the developers are Swedes, but I know the board game is Swedish. So I suspect that uh, it would be good that it has some Swedish developers making this to transfer over the Swedishness. Hmm. I'm surprised okay, so... it didn't recognize the environment, but it looks very well Look like Valheim. Beautiful. Just beautiful. This scrap's gonna make us heroes back at the Ark. Okay, scrap can be exchanged for weapons, consumables, and outfits in the Ark shop. Okay. Let's see, I was thinking of yes, something. Looks like mutants. Not just any mutants. Stalkers. Tight muscles. Good meat. I smell them too. Where there's stalkers, there's Ark. Where there's Ark, there's killing time for Skizzix and Treble. They're close, 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 close. Over there. Come, brother. I'm on their trail. Okay, I'm guessing humanity not as extinct as possibly thought. Because those look human or humanoid. Marauder. Hmm. Tactical combat. Combat is turn based. Each stock gets two action points per turn. Some actions such as shooting, throwing, or sprinting will end your turn once used. Okay, here we go with the XCOM. Uh, from what I've heard, uh, or what I've seen, this, this, this is similar to XCOM 2. Let's see. Uh, let's wait with moving you. Can we switch to you? Yes, we can. Um... Let's see, it'd probably be best if you move you somewhere. Hmm. Okay, it... This would alert because... Uh, it, they would be running, which would make too much noise. Okay. We'll alert new units. Hmm. Okay. Oop, I accidentally pressed spacebar there. Hold Q to rotate the camera. Q 
cover. Low cover, 25% bonus. Well, full, 75. Okay, that's... That's something that XCOM never actually tells, I think, as just how much of a bonus it gives. Just that full cover is better than half cover. Blanking will cancel bonus, okay. Let's see. A lot of heck. I miss walking in woods like these. And yes, we have many woods where there's so many flowers between the trees that it's insane. Okay, let's start. You move in the cover and shoot. Ow. Ooh, okay, then. Finally figured out how to use that thing. Okay, fire will hurt. He's burning. Oh, hello, air. We need it. Oh, yeah, and he wasted all of his moves there. Okay, Bormin. Uh, I don't... Yeah, let's just shoot. There's no way. Got you. <laughs> nope. That was awesome. Okay. Now have to regroup. this far south before, right in our neighborhood. I don't like it. Hmm. Okay, ghouls. I'm guessing that's you. what's left of humanity. Weapon mod collected. Broiler 50. Plus one critical damage. 50% it's burn. Okay. Ancient fire torch when attached to any weapon. This will give a chance of shooting flaming projectiles. Good against flesh enemies. Chronicler Elvis. Okay. Yeah. One thing I know that people love about this game is the flavor text. Okay. <clears throat> bit choppy, so let me lower the graphics some. That's there we go. Low. There it runs smoothly. Well, it does still look good, even on low graphic. Yeah. Is, okay, it's not all yeah, pixelated or anything. Uh, can we... Okay, shift changes. I have to say... If it even looks good in low graphic, it means that whoever made this game did it with great care. Okay, some more scrap. And we need to go this way. And there's more ghouls. Ghouls. I don't like the look of that big one. We have to be sneaky. Okay, here's the plan. We turn off our lights, then hug the water. Go around them. Okay, so we don't... Red Skulls. Too high level for your team and we'll kill you. Okay, <laughs> simple as that. Void Red Skull enemies and explore the zone to find encounters that match your team's level. Okay. So... It's hot. Oh, yep. Yeah, we want to... We want that light I off. Whip off their tiny stalker arms and beat their faces till they die! Faces too ugly to beat. No one loves a stalker. Give me the stalkers. Let them come. Where are you? Ark don't even love stalkers. <laughs> okay, they're quite a bit insane. Yeah, and with the name of Ghoul, you may give have an idea of what they also are. Yeah, it sounds like they'd be zombified and that. Some plant has been growing absolutely wild here. Yeah, and I was more into of cannibalistic. Hmm. It's Delta, Delta, it said something about Delta will give you weapons, something. The up ahead. Home, sweet home. Oh, I'm gonna kiss that elevator when I see it. Get upstairs, take a bath, get a grog with the boys, get another grog with the boys, foot massage. Oh, it's gonna be great. A campsite. Looks like a family lived here. Lived here and died here. Nothing like a bunch of skeletons to put your mind at ease. Yeah, some died in each other's arms. Oh, hello, what's this, Sarni? Med kits. Always useful in whatever game you're playing. It's. I wasn't expecting to be 
moving around like this. I was expecting more like a lot more XCOM 2 like style. Well, it's more like an open world XCOM. There's a cat or like XCOM combined with ball escape or something. Google vibe coming off of it. So we run in, guns blazing. Too dangerous. <laughs> If we're sneaky, we can get into a good position. A good position keeps us alive. Turn off your flashlight. Okay. Sneaking. If you're undetected, you can scope out enemy positions and kill isolated weak enemies using your silent weapons. Like the duck has. This can tip the balance of a fight into your favor by reducing overall enemy numbers. Okay, yeah, that would not be possible at all in uh, XCOM. There's... Typically, when things get, when one enemy gets alerted, all of them get alerted. Hungry, hungry. I says we take the ark, taste the mutants. <laughs> Love me some mutants. <laughs> and we go, rip their hearts, crush their. Hey, hey. You hear that? You hear that noise? I hear my stomach. Hungry, kill. Okay, you hide there. Okay. An old playground. Oh. Uh, okay, Porky, you can stay there for now. Can we? Yes, we can. Okay. Can we take out that guy? Alert new units. Okay. And then. Okay, yeah, that, that's just an instant kill. Bye bye. Another one bites the ducks. <laughs> okay, that's a bad pun even for me. Let's see, mutation points. Can we use to unlock powerful combat mutations? Okay, he gets wings. Improve your stalker stats, such as health or movement. Okay, let's have a look. Major, minor, or passive. Only one can be set in your loadout. One of each. Okay. Stat bonuses are permanent and are always applied regardless of loadout. Loadout can be changed in the inventory at any time outside of combat. Let's see. Health booster. And you have access to Skull Splitter. 100% crit chance, 20% accuracy. Enhanced critical chance allows you to pop the head of an enemy as easily as popping the balls and bombs out. Ugh. This wild behavior will cost you some accuracy. And it takes kills to recharge. Hmm. And you need two mutation points to get started on this. Run and gun. Enables an action after sprinting. After using your second action point, your body can trigger a burst of reserve stamina, which allows you to perform an action afterward. Used for harassing enemies who are far away from the crew. Note, this must be activated before you have spent both action points. That'll be useful, so we're saving up for the next uh, <clears throat> for the next level up for that. For now, though, I'm not too sure about this one. Like, only 20% accuracy? Hmm... I'm very confused. 100% critical chance. Or oh, by... minus 25% accuracy. Okay. I, I misread that. There's, it would have been better if they put uh, a comma in between there. Yeah, though it's, it's confusing for... Sure, you have l less chance to uh, hit, but when you do hit, you hit harder? Yeah. Let's grab this here. Some more scrap. Now let's see. Oh. That one felt very oddly double-edged sword, but it, maybe I'm overthinking it. Let's see. Activating user unit will engage it into combat. Ignoring it will allow you to keep it hidden in the same location for later. Unit units can be spotted by the enemy in combat if they get too close. Okay. So basically keeping them... Uh, in reserve for ambushes. Uh, ignore. Actually, it would be prob uh, probably be better if I move you 
up here. Though he has a shotgun. Uh, okay, so I can't climb these outside of enough combat. Okay. Uh, ducks. Let's see. Move you there. Now, let's see. If I were to shoot... Okay. Chance to hit... Seven. Okay, it, it, it gives it a section up here. We are... F if we get closer, we'd get 100% chance. Uh, weapon... Okay, hidden gives 20... Yeah, it gives 15% chance to crit. So we have 20 in total. We can switch weapons. Still a bit far away. Hmm. And if we were to activate Skull Splitter, it would only be a 50% chance to hit. Hmm. Let's but see. It will go to him instantly for I don't think it's calculated the amount of crit damage it will do. Yeah. Okay, climb up. Let's see. If you were to oh you would absolutely eradicate this guy. Uh, how can I switch targets with this? Or is the other guy simply out of range? Scatter gun damage are. five, critical eight. Okay. Hmm. Let's try maneuvering around to get this guy to, close to the hunter and then the ducks close to the marauder. Weapon parts can be spent to upgrade your weapons in the arc. Okay. And you move around for the Marauder. Technically, we could just move, sneak past, but these guys are worth experience. Yep, and it's one of the big games that it may take a while for the combat, may be long, and you have to do a lot of it. Should I fight or should I not fight? Yeah. We lost one. So good. Okay. Time to switch targets. Okay, activate. And only okay, only fifty percent chance. Actually, we can we can move up. Well, we could move up closer if we weren't hidden behind everything. Let's see. Oh, okay, that is very nice. It it shows you the amount of uh, percentage to hit you have from a, from a spot. So let's move here. That is nice. And there we go. Some more. Okay, that is going to hurt um, this time. No, that. That would have hurt <laughs> if he wasn't blind as hell. Well, he just got shot in the back. Wait, no chance to hit. Oh, cover. Okay. Yeah, cover can be an odd in these types of games. Uh, okay, I see. Yeah. The co the, nice. It isn't the um, defense or anything that the cover raises. It's the amount... Yeah, of uh, accuracy it lowers. Boombox. A strange talking box that hisses at you like a snake when powered on. Sometimes, depending on where it is placed, it will speak to you with beeps, whistles, or even faint voices. It includes a handy slot on the front for keeping things in. Chronicler's Weeb. Okay, so Look these mutants. Beauty. The ancients left a lot of ugly junk behind, but once in a while you see something like this. Wonder what these buttons are for. I wouldn't touch it if I were you. I'm not kidding around. Lay off the buttons. What's up your butt? That's a bomb, all right. They used to call it a boom box. Touch that red button, and it goes boom. 
Don't be pretending you know what any of. Oh, yeah. Okay, they don't really understand uh, human or ancient tech, it seems. Gaper can destroy covers, knocks back enemies. This gas powered cannon, humorously named after the type of damage it's been known to deliver, you know, launches fat, chunky shells. When the Gaper loses what the Gaper loses in subtlety, it gains back in power. Can knock back most enemies. Chronicler Eli. Okay, will they continue the chat? No. That that's too bad. Okay. So if we were to do this, we'd have to, uh, yeah, wait for them to finish talking. Yeah. I think some people complained there was not that much story. Though what they suspect is it's easy to miss much of the story if you rush through it. Yeah. Well, that's with most games if you rush through. Yep. Let's see. This of game course, the world ends. You did it to us. When the ice melted, you said nothing. When the plague spread, you did nothing. When the nukes dropped, you became nothing. At least that's what the Elder says. But cheer up. You'll be happy to know that despite your mistakes, life remains. In a small settlement high above a raging river, people are living and thriving. We call it the Ark. The Ark is humanity's last outpost. A lonely island in an ocean of chaos. Okay. Within these walls, we help each other create a new civilization on the ruins of the old one, with the guidance of our leader, the Elder. The Elder tells us we're safe as long as we never leave, because outside these walls lies the zone, the never-ending wasteland. A mass grave spanning the planet, littered with your crumbling monuments to your hubris and arrogance. What the Elder chooses not to tell us is our food and water supplies are running dangerously low. That's why he relies on stalkers, adventurers who leave the Ark, explore the zone and scavenge for precious resources. Stalkers are tough enough to resist the rot and they got the smarts and the firepower to keep the zone ghouls at bay. Stalkers have to be more than human. That's me, Mr. More Than Human, a.k.a. a mutant. I look weird to you, but hey, you look weird to me. So let's leave it at that. If the Stalkers come back from the zone alive, the Ark survives another day. If the Stalkers don't come back, the legacy of mankind will be lost forever. At least... That's what the Elder says. Okay, so to summarize, this is sort of like the Stalker games, only it's global. Let's see. Working yeah. artifacts are rare in the zone. They even use similar t terminology like Stalker and Zone. And okay, then I was wrong. Ghouls are just mutated, well, not, home, they're home. insane humans. The elevator's up ahead. Well, then, probably no longer just humans anymore. Yeah. Related, yes, just... Two ghouls, see them? Something new. What are those rod heads up to? Wait, they're planning to ambush the elevator. We've got to stop them. Let's sneak around and see if there's others. Rot head with a capital R. Yes, they are infected box with rot. We go in the box. Box goes in the ark. We take their food. We take their guns. Mutants in the ark. Too many. Too many. Mutants are weak. We kill some fast. We kill some slow. But we kill them all. Box is coming. We kill them all. <laughs> okay. Are there more? Yes, there are more of them. Yeah, I think you can see 
that their IQ has really been affected. Yeah. Though I guess IQ has nothing to do with speech, but still they... Yeah, they are very, very simple-minded. Yeah, simple and single-minded. Now let's... Hopefully the boar doesn't set him off. And he's actually... Okay, he's not coming this way. Yeah, but I think the only care about is killing and eating. Yeah. Hmm. Okay, let's wait for this marauder over here to walk away again. Like he is doing now. Hmm. Okay, not enough. Yeah, if we kill that one, he would alert the other. Uh, actually, that's going to leave this one alone now, I think. Unless there is more hidden around here. Oop. Camp Moose. Okay. Some scrap. Okay, it seems like it's only four of them. I wonder what that one was in English. From what I saw, that moose looked like a reference to a comic book character around here. Okay. Alien Helge. It's basically our... Not it. To say it simply, he's a... a He's our own version of uh, Bugs Bunny. He has even his own hunter he has to deal with. <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah, best to take out that Marauder when he's alone. Since he's mobile. More weapon parts. Yeah, this, this game certainly looks interesting. Though it will likely be a long-ass game to play. Yeah. Sure, you could rush it, but... Yeah, rushing it is... It's one of the worst things you probably would do in this game, or it would only make it way unnecessarily harder for you. Yeah. You you would be rewarded a lot for exploring, for well, find more scrap items and all that, but it would take much longer. It would probably make the battles go faster for Imash than those who have been trying to rush the game. Also, end up making taking it longer due to. Not being able to progress the fights fast enough because they're too weak. Okay. Activate. Shoot. Only 50% chance to hit, but it will kill no matter what. So. Hmm. Why is that red? Or is it more like that it's blocking? Hmm. That's why it thinks you want to attack it. Let's wait for him to get closer. There we go. I was sort of worried that Bormir would get spotted, but luckily not. Okay, activate, shoot. Yeah, you're dead. I double dead. Ow! Oh. Okay. Over here. All right. Now we take out this guy, and then we sneak around to take out both of these at once, if possible. Let's see. 75% chance if we move there. We stay undetected because we're moving from cover to cover. There we go. You just sit here and hide. I feel like this is one of the games who experimented with the XCOM formula and doing it quite well. Yeah. So it is like XCOM, but very different enough. Serves you okay. right. Okay. So scrap his goods. 
And once we've dealt with these two, I think we can call it then. Yeah, yeah for it, this game can take quite a while. Yeah. Okay, you go hide there. You hide there, and let's ambush. But yeah, if we want to stream this, we probably should investigate how long it might take. Yeah. Let's see. We'll alert new units. Okay. Hmm. Actually, once we start... What is that? A, a hunter. He has a rifle, so he'll probably look for cover the moment that he can. So he'll probably head towards... If we start shooting from this way, he's probably going to go over here for cover. And then we'll have Boromir waiting for him. In okay. Overwatch? Hmm. Actually... That will alert. That will alert. Can I sneak up on them behind there? Okay. I, I like that you don't get stuck in the combat like that. And you can freely leave it as long as, well, you can. You haven't been detected yet. 50% okay. chance. Better than before, but no, let's... Okay, we switch like that. You... Ducks, activate, shoot, 75%, good enough. Okay. Yeah, I've no, didn't know shit he heard us. Okay. And yeah, if this misses, I'll, I'll eat my slipper. Bye bye. Don't it. Well, he didn't miss. Okay, just walk up. And bye bye. Stay down. Nice. Ooh, ancient sights. Twenty percent added to weapon range. Iron sight from a war that predates the arc. Old but sturdy. Increases the range of whatever weapon it is mounted on. Chronicler Dementus. I would not really trust someone's memory who is called Dementus. Okay, let's stop sneaking. Regroup. I don't like the ghouls being this close to the Ark. Quick, inside the elevator, so we can get to safety. Okay, and yeah, let's head in, see whatever story that gives us, and then we'll call it on this one. Yes, this one, this one is a hard. This is a hard yes leaning maybe. It'll just yeah, have to. We'll just have to look how long it takes. The Elder meets us at the elevator. He says he doesn't have a second to lose. The mission's too important. Our mission, he says, is a man. And that man is Hammond. Everyone in the Ark knows Hammond, respects him. He's our lead, gearhead, going farther into the zone than anybody else, bringing back the machines that help us survive. He knows how to keep those machines running. How to fix them when they fall apart. Hammond keeps the Ark's heart beating. The Elder says three nights ago, Hammond took his team of stalkers and headed north, not telling anyone why. They haven't come back. I've never seen the Elder this shaken before. It scares me. He tells us Hammond has a remote cabin in the north that could yield some clues to his location. Me and Ducks never patrolled that far before, but the Elder says he has faith in us. He believes in us. So, this mission we accept. Go to Hammond's cabin, search for clues, then find Hammond and bring him back alive. The fate of the Ark depends on it. And that's how Porky and Daffy are set on the road to Eden, I'm guessing. And wait, is that why is that why the loading item loading icon is a dice? 
Now, this is a <laughs> a board game. Uh, yeah, so. I told you. I told you earlier uh, on Discord that it is based on a board game. Okay, that I missed then. Let's see, save game. Se oh, session. Okay, so there's multiple save slots as well. Probably okay. needed. Let's see. <laughs> Why does he have a, high, a top hat here? Uh. I think you find that early on, but don't I don't remember fully. Okay, next game. Taking a look at the time, 120, oh. so to 150. And of course, get the game to be captured oh. in this. This game, I have seen this game, and it is funny. Welcome to Nefarious, which from all I've seen, let me lower that volume a bit. It looks like a Shantae, but evil. <laughs> uh, where is the... Okay, no audio chain. Okay. Well, I think I remember what... If I remember right, both this game... This game has two endings. Okay. And I should see just the as the first name of this. So, yeah, it's it all up to you, and I don't know how con the controls work. They don't seem to be working now. Um, did it? Uh, the hell is going on now? Hmm? It's not responding. Okay. Hmm. Okay then, take two. Uh, yeah, let's avoid the options then, but a bit bad that it doesn't have a volume mixer in there. Or is that some... Hmm. Let's get that cursor off screen, or at least in the corner. Stop me if you've heard this one before. Bad guy crashes party, kidnaps princess, makes dramatic exit. Plucky handsome hero gives chase. Epic quest ensues. But funny story. Yeah, I'm the bad guy. The curse of my name will be caked on the walls of those who serve justice. <laughs> okay. It's a really necessary May apple. <laughs> Let's see. Wanted alias crow. Beware jumping, <laughs> not just for heroes. Okay. That's how it looks like without this helmet. Oh, right. oh we, we still took damage there, okay. And we can break these. Okay. And we can actually aim our strike, okay. And... Oop. What? Oh no, it's a spirit animal! <laughs> the dodo. Simulated extinct meal. No, meat. <laughs> Okay. And yeah, for uh, people don't know, I wonder if you asked the Helium, what is a spirit animal? And he replied with Dodo. This this looks a lot like uh, Lady Penelope's car from uh, Thunderbirds, only it has one less set of wheels. What's this? Okay. Oh, okay, those letters. Those laws jump higher. Okay. And they also allow us to jump again. Ooh. Checkpoint. Locked. Keys over chumps. So 
the pawn shot is open his puppy up. Yes. <laughs> Give me that. See, we're getting pounds, I think. I think that's a symbol for pounds. Yeah, I think so. I think that means that there's three crowns in every level. And I think we take contact damage from enemies. And that was a <laughs> that was a health item. Okay, so when something is gray is darkened like that, it means that it's in the background. If it's not, then it's in the foreground. Oh, hey, what's more stepping you out? <laughs> Yeesh, my bad. Is this meant to look like Mario's pipes? Only sure, actually. Okay, adopt a pod. Pick up your eight-legged friend today. Uh, maybe not. <laughs> Achievements, feeling punchy. <laughs> let's see. Oh, wait, yeah, let's not get over there. Something hidden under this. We felt the other perimeter as you requested. And we set up your death ray just up ahead. Time to start this assault in earnest. Ernest. <laughs> oh. This is the MCPD. Put the princess down or we will open fire. You don't know, sir, so it's not bulletproof, right? <laughs> Okay, that's better boss mu boss like music. Okay, apparently they didn't care much that the prince is in bulletproof. And we need to punch these guys towards that thing. Okay. Or the did I just punch that book with the rockets? Or that was fast? <laughs> Okay, uh, mini boss. Uh, boss, that was awesome. Hey, Tyrone, how's the family? Hey, Miss Mayapple. <laughs> Great, thanks for asking. <laughs> Knock it off. Stop being nice to my minions. <laughs> and for us, have Becky send my care package. Oh. What can happen here? Watch for grenades. Okay. It's, it's going a bit slow with this, but that's nice. Uh, 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 right on time, my old rival, Mac. Mac, my hero. Bro, May Apple. Well, he's completely disinterested, and that's the second crown. Don't you have some heroic banter you'd like to toss my way? Let's go get in your giant eyeball laser or whatever it is. <laughs> then I can kick your butt and we can get on with this. I need to talk to May Apple. Okay, I, I like that the tutorials are. Uh, I like that the tutorials are in the, these posters. Yeah, and I kind of like it. Yeah, yeah, tutorial also used it to. Well, in, a, in somewhat of an idea of, of the world and characters. Yeah. Those grenades don't work directly, but they do work on the buttons. Checkpoint. Ah, 
out. Okay, you are going to be annoying. There we go. I have to say, I, I find it refreshing that an, an in-media rest or in the middle of the action start like this is taking it rather calmly. And there's the last crown. This well hotel! Oh, there's a... Is that our ship? I think so. It is purple. Finally, my knight in shining armor, my hero, my love. My apple, I'm breaking <laughs> with you. <laughs> well, that's a mood swing. <laughs> what? Now you're doing this right now? Look at that face. <laughs> Hello, super villain, right here. We barely see each other anymore. You spend more time with Crow than me. Because he kidnaps me. And now you're defending him. You two are inseparable. <laughs> uh, guys, yeah, for a moment I thought those were his teeth, but that's his hand. <laughs> McIntray, Donald, Mulder, you get up here and rescue your princess this instant. I don't have time for this anymore. I have real crimes to stop. <laughs> Burn. Hey, I'm committing a real crime here. A nerve. I have never been so insulted. I know, right? Well, this is awkward. And victory music plan and everything for the day. Finally, the Viet Mac. Let's just go. Yeah, okay. Can I still play the music? <laughs> Sure, whatever. <laughs> Press enter to enter the sovereign. It... <laughs> okay, that was a that was a nice subversion. He just gave up, huh? I might be a villain, but he's the real jerk here. Becky. Boss, Princess Mayapple, shall I have the men prepare your suite? Hey, Bex. No, I think I'll go gaze off the deck <laughs> wistfully for a while. I have some steam I need to blow off. Very well. I should say that the minions prepare your usual spelt risotto and a nice side of soup. <laughs> Christo? What? <laughs> This is so I don't command fear anymore. He just flew away. Plus, I believe you may be able to utilize this as an opportunity. Of course, I know that. I wanted to win, but not like this. Perhaps you can clue me in on what exactly the plan is? We never seem to keep May Apple long enough to move on to step two. Kidnapping the princess is a time <laughs> tradition. I've been putting together plans for a royalty-powered death ray and... <laughs> oh, gosh, this doesn't feel right. Evil scheme monologues should be dictated to heroes before I destroy them. Uh, I would think as your major domo, it is prudent to keep me in the loop. Here is all you need to know. I'm a genius and we need five princesses. Once that is complete, I can rule the world and reshape it as I see fit. Uh, give me a moment... Okay, this game isn't too loud, but because of the audio limiter. Very well, then we must now travel abroad to the other kingdoms. And hopefully, whose heroes will give a freaking damn. The Syndicate of Malice will not look favorably if we start kidnapping the designated princesses of other villains. I'm sure now I can find a loophole to bypass protocol laws. Next up is Princess Apoide. Apoide? From the Insertia Kingdom. Like. Insertia. 
Ragnar. Hi, man. When you are ready to proceed, go up to the ele go up the elevator to the bridge and take the wheel. <laughs> okay, this game is charming. Yeah, and that's what this is. Did a bit of weird spelling of insect. Yes, we spell it with a K. Linden Meyer, thanks for the job, boss. Just imagine if any hunter hired me, I would have been stuck in inheriting the family lime farm. What a relief, right? They say yeah, I get my own pony. I like ponies, Andy. Okay, he's easily bribed. And we can't talk to you yet. Okay. There's a lot of gears in this thing, and a lot of creaking as well. Any huge explosions scatters for today, boss? Reload blast. <laughs> How kind of name is that? Good question! Uh, this thing is just kept together by duct tape and bubble gum, isn't it? From all the creaking. Yeah, I don't Hello. know why there's so many cogs. Uh, hello there. Albert Frost. Hey boss, have you ever considered writing a book about all your adventures? Okay. Becky, you will be glad to know I've issued a new memo to the minions. You are no longer allowed to have meetings next to explosive red barrels. <laughs> what did I think of that? Hindsight is 2020. Let's see. Sovereign team. Okay. Extra music that we can unlock. Hello there, Iro. Oh, neat. Meatloaf today in the cafeteria. Again. Not that I'm complaining or anything, sir. That's the other guy. Screaming Weasel. If I keep telling myself another day in paradise, eventually I'll start to believe it. <laughs> yeah, who are you? Maxim? Hey, boss. I don't think I can take another one of these princesses in another castle's joke to <laughs> keep spouting. Mission to boss the cap. <laughs> Granted. <laughs> what the? Minion of the month and then worst minion of the month. <laughs> okay. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Let's see. I can't believe he broke up with me. I can't believe he didn't even try to thwart me. I can just imagine the tabloid headlines. Princess faces despair on death ray. My apple has turned to sour. It's actually better. At least my true calling. Okay. Um, I get the. F can we jump? No, we can't jump off our own ship. <laughs> Are you pulling him? Okay. Yeah, this this, this game has charm up the ass. Yeah, yeah we I love punch the charm. <laughs> we punch the steering wheel. Oh, we can actually move around freely a bit. Oh yeah, Insectia. Insection, insectant Kingdom. Okay. Let's see. Oh, hello, Becky. We're stepping out of our comfort zones here, boss. But I have received intel report about the Princess Apo Apodi. She rules Insectia with an iron thorax. <laughs> or iron mandible, whatever it is that <laughs> insects rule with. It's a thorax. Isn't that the butt? Sure. Get in, get that the prisoner, princess, and, and get out. Yeah, but it does. I'm just playing drops. It... And you missed every damn coin! Yep. Hello there. Look at fencing wasps or bees. And we can't get that. Wait, 
this. <laughs> Friends B music. Okay. Okay, one. Well, all of these coins are probably going to be for upgrades. Okay. Nice design. Yeah, they put a lot of work into this game. Yeah. Yep. Here's the crown. I forgot to pick up Kickstarter the watch. Well, it has a good feeling of a git. It, it has a bit of a feel of a Kickstarter game. A good one at that. Not the many, many shit ones. The heck was that? You're a, a beetle. Force field generator with some shooters behind it. Okay. Can I stand on that? No, I can't. What the hell kind of noise was that, bro? Okay, is there him way into that? We can punch a wall, but not walk through it. Okay. okay. There must be a hidden, a hidden uh, entry into that place. Checkpoint again. Is that all love or is it honey? I think that's honey. Probably for the best that it is that and not lava. Yeah. It's also a bit too early for lava level. Yeah. So, honey should be a bit thicker than that seems to be. Okay, let's have a look here. Oh, oh, hello, music. You've added Thorax Vault to your jukebox. Meat. The jury is still out on what exactly a Sorax is. <laughs> I, I actually have no idea either. I know. But they will tell it later. So, you know, do you want me to tell it, say it now? Uh, no. Plus, well, it appears that you have been sealed in. Uh, have you seen Stand by sending a squad of minions to override the control center. Okay, combat arena. Achievement for explosion. We're getting 50 uh, kills. See? Okay. Yeah, standard combat arena and uh, hello there. Nobody keeps this bird in its shades. And some free kills. Because those guys are going to chase me down here, aren't they? Yep. They put the... Okay. As for you all, enjoy a grenade. Voila! Wasn't aiming for him. Okay, typical hit when they're not defending themselves any. Oh, hello there. What is the meaning of this? You're not my usual kidnapper. <laughs> Scorpio. <laughs> New York. Yeah, called in sick. Bad cold. I highly doubt that. Scorpio is a robot. <laughs> really? Because I was totally picturing a giant scorpion. Now he gets to the lots. Okay. You're coming with. And... Okay, because she's, she's flapping her wings, so we can actually jump higher. Okay. Nice little mechanic. Is that I going to... 
Is it going to happen with every princess that we kidnap? That I have forgotten about. I don't know, they all have the uh, hidden thing. All characters are quite well made. The, the only one that you definitely want to punch is probably Mac. People will know why. Because he just ran off like a jackass. Yeah, I don't think he gets. Uh, may have lost a lot of public opinion. Okay, I need to be more preemptive with these attacks. Because it takes half a second for the, the attack to come out. It's a literal heart container. I only just noticed. Hey, then again, I don't get the shot to see that until you drive them. Go. Say, Princess, what's a thorax? Excuse me? And a bug. Is the cork the thorax the butt? Can we keep this kidnapping on a professional level, please? Yeesh, sorry I asked. Oh, hello. Yeah. I'll just have to make a run little platform to get that. There we go. Okay. A dragonfly! But everyone knows, actually. Wait. And oh, wait, that was the helmet. Punch Mageddon achievement. I thought for a moment that they had doors on the chest, but now they just have belt. Yeah. Or what that supposed to be. Yeah. Okay, almost down. And yeah, the aiming is a bit off. No, or off for me at least. Because you either It's even butterfingers, okay. Uh, yeah, you can aim your punch with the right hand stick here. Because uh, now I'm using the controller. But it also moves when you move the left stick. But yeah, it's so it's either aiming your punches or jumping. Unless that's one of the... Okay. I can also jump with the right... Uh, with, no, with the left shoulder button. Okay. Yeah, that'll help a lot. It'll get some getting used to, at the very least. You need that. Oh, 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 oh. That was... <laughs> I, that, that was close. That I have forgotten about. I mostly remember about the characters than the levels. And that hopefully it's a good sign if I remember more about the characters. But in your case, that wouldn't probably mean that I wouldn't be able to help you if you get stuck. No, uh, won't be too much of a problem, I think. I okay, that one just dropped in right on top of me. One of you drop me some health. Achievement Grenadier. Probably for throwing 20 uh, grenades. Oh. 
are covered in the spikes or something, but these are just bees. Yeah. Well, let me run into the box. But, uh... You know, because you're jumping at them, I guess you jump into the shop feet and, uh, yeah, testing your... Yeah, at least it's, they're dropping health frequently. So we tried holding down the palace in your wake. Uh, Dash is hot on your heels. Dash? Let me send down my death pod. It's on the way, sir. Extraction point locked in. Send the summit of this tower to run it. Okay, Dash is probably this hilarious hero. And I get the feeling he's going to give more of a damn than Mac did. Yeah, I hope you've been able to... Oh, who is that? He needs a reference, too. Okay, give me that. What is Why are the blowers here? Or... Okay, the, the... No, this round like... isn't dangerous. Okay, that, that's quite something there, and... Uh, uh, <laughs> oh, come on, an eggmobile? Not so fast. Yes, you've come to rescue me. Evil is afoot in the kingdom of Insectia, and that's no good. Better be knocked off your soapbox, Neil Mose. Okay, he's a reference to Sonic, isn't he? Yep. Including you at this point. Uh, oh, that was homie. Unfortunately, most of us would eat so many uh, wheel of cheese. Okay, this, this ball is quite difficult to maneuver. And he's he's putting in quite a few hits. Yeah. Oh, yeah, what's going on? Yeah, in this game, you're all basically being the boss in the boss fights. Yep, ow. Out. And well, <laughs> that's okay. Immediately puts us back. Not not even a screen for transition. Okay. Okay. Yeah, it is. This game is fun, but also rather dumb. But uh, entirely on purpose. Yeah, but you is also very unique. Yeah. Okay, but the physics on this thing is quite strange. Can I actually move more than just like this? I can't tell if it deals any more damage if we move faster with these things or with this thing. That's a good question. So it seems if you do get him in a real strong enough arm, she can stop him, apparently. I think it was from hitting the tower whilst he was standing on top of it. Yet he was he was stunned there for half a second ish. There we go. And bang. I couldn't tell if it did any more damage or not. And we lost control again. Ok, 
go. And losing control again. There we go. Smack. Kick your butt. Check. <laughs> Kidnap the princess. Double check. with you. All that smashing is you can slide away. Okay. Yeah. The back back boss. I see the plan is going smoothly. What a dreadful dread port. Is this where I am to be launched? Then good company May Apple can show you around the facilities. Hmm. I've been doing some research on what you said before, boss. Everyone knows there is some magical force surrounding princesses. That's right, everyone. Something ancient, powerful. You're planning on harnessing that power to the real world? It's the power of Doomsday device. The Doom Howitzer. That is ruthless. I have to say, boss, I'm a little impressed. What a delightfully evil plan. We must now continue our campaign then to the east. The Dwarven Kingdom of Winterdown. The Ogre Kingdom of Sukochi. They have been in conflict for years. We'll have to take advantage of this chaos. It doesn't matter which one you do first, either way, we have to get them both. Okay. There are two new levels. Alright, that, that's it for this one, though. Oh, here is the audio. Okay. Yeah. Okay, that that one is a... That's one of those... That one's on the list. So, it is... It is a bit uh, quiet between when you're... Uh, leaving and get uh, be between when you leave the ship and to get the princess. Um, I hope that doesn't get repeated with each level that there's more just interaction going on a bit. But still, probably a short game, but still going on the list. So now we move sure. on to the last of these. I'm sure mm -hmm. short is the correct term, but it is plenty of uh, character interaction as such. Okay. Is this, in this case, a part of its charm. But I don't think it's super long either. But it's not super short as well. Okay, and here's the last game. Nibiru, who it's some, for some reason OBS catches when it's still set to capture Nefarious. Let me actually Nibiru. check here. That's a name I've not heard in a while. Yeah, it's game capture, capture specific window, Nefarious. And somehow it captures this. I don't know what's going on. It might have something to do with the update Windows is trying to force through, which keeps failing. Which has kept messing with my audio and my mic. Because for once, some reason, it, once again, my mic got disconnected from OBS. Which is a good oh, thing that I yeah. caught that before we started. But yeah, Nibiru, I know nothing about this game. I have no idea where or when I picked it up. I know that it's supposed to be a shooter. I only know about Nibiru through name. I forgot if it's part of mythology or something. For I heard the name before, and there are theories that there are some aliens that, if I if I could remember correctly, that some aliens that have been in here before are from there. Okay. Might be the aliens, the uh, alien figurines they found in uh, Mesopotamia or something that are related to Nibiru. Again, it's been a while I listened to those, and I don't believe in conspiracy theories, but it can be sometimes interesting to listen to. Hmm. Even if they sometimes are outright dumb. Well, I guess this says that how uh, active this game is, as in, it's completely dead online. Wait, it's that kind of... Wait, what? Yeah, I didn't... I didn't see if it was specifically a multiplayer uh, player game because I avoid those because there's no story to play through typically hmm. oh yeah if this turns out to be nothing then we can quit early because we're already at two hours oh dear 
and it's taking quite a bit to load. It, did it just... Okay, for more than that, it froze up for a moment. Curious with all of this, of what it is, but it might just—it might just be that it's nothing. And come on, you're you're one hundred percent loaded. Load up. Yeah, I'm not really not sure of this game. And for good reason, perhaps. Could it be a failed uh, survival game? Not sure, but it does seem that it is stuck like this. And then Elvis starts playing? The hell? Yeah, I think it's stuck. Let me ex Let's open up Steam quick. Store page. What are the reviews for this? Uh, great. Okay, that explains. What? It's been uh, delisted from Steam. If, if I try to go to the store page, there is no store page. And... Hmm. Is it Community Hub? Let's see. Store page missing. Is the store page gone for anyone else? What happened? Bugs in the multiplayer? Suggestions for the game? It does look like it would be a sort of No Man's Sky-like game. From these images I'm seeing here. Um, I get the... Okay, let's just let's just give it the benefit of the doubt for the moment and end program. Come on, end pro. There we go. Hmm. Okay, made with Unity FS Studio. If something says made with Unity at the front, it typically means that they use the free version of Unity, which is not always a good sign. It doesn't have to mean that every game that has that sucks. But a good amount do. Hmm. Oh yeah, let's give it another try to start up. If it fails to, then yeah, then this game is automatic. This game just doesn't work then. Let's help it a bit along by setting the graphics. It, it didn't save. Oh well, I didn't press applied, so that's on me then. Let's wait. It has only ultra and low. Come on, then you're just plain lying. Okay, apply. I said, wait, now. High, medium. The heck? Is it being slow with changing these sub these? Okay, there, there's a pause when you change the graphics quality. That isn't too good of a, a sign, I think. Let's see. Wait, did we click continue? If if I clicked continue, then it might have been bad. Oh, yes, we did. So there was no there was no world to continue on. So of course there was nothing to happen. Then why is continue an available button to click at the start? I thought it was a failed game and it got removed due to uh, something. Let's see. Miner, increased mining, gunsmith, doctor, alchemist, alchemist, and... Wait, you're in the game? Uh, I'm at a selection screen now. I'm sharing it to you now. So, yeah, it, it, oh. it failed to load because we hadn't had a, uh, a world collect, select... We hadn't had a world made or a character selected yet. Um... 
Soldier recipe of first level weapons creation, repairmen. Hmm. Let's go with Jacqueline here. Let's see if it loads in now. This isn't promising though. If it's removed from the storefront, then there's probably good reasons for that. So let's give this game up to 15 minutes and then call it just to see what it has to offer. Yeah. If it has anything to offer at all. Yeah, if it's going to stop it, it's either for the developer side that they ask for it or they did something that angered Steam a lot. Yeah. And I... huh? What do you say? It, it's taking quite a bit of... It's, it's not taking long to load, but it's taking uh, longer than should be expected with just the graphics card oh, that I have. Yeah. All plans down the drain. We need to look around. Okay, they, they they do the voice acting themselves. Let's see. Inspect the crash set and the remains of the ship and sound of someone like something taken from public domain. Even him. Yeah, he's from Hitchhiker's Guide of the Galaxy, and why the hell was he dancing to Elvis music? Yeah, he's not a perfect copy, but very, very, uh, very obviously. In that a, scenario, uh, it will not last long. It's worth looking for the remains of the ship's food, mm. and even better if oh. you can find weapons and medicine. He's the one yeah. talking. All of this has the uh, has the stink of crappy game in it on it. Is that you talking? Actually, you just it's stay talking. there. Pistol, pistol cartridges, smart. take all. Okay, dual wheel immediately. It seems the yeah, and also something else to notice to between the characters. Is not enough for mm -hmm. a long time. The female characters look more badass. I mean, what they make us look like... Oxygen tanks well... And battery. Hurry up. Meh. Look like they have a, a poor quality uniform or something. Let's see, what did it... Okay, that... This looks a lot better than... Um... What the heck am I hearing now? And I... Th oh, Beanie is going to stream in 5 to 10 minutes. It okay, just a big... ...ass slug. That takes quite a bit more. Okay, yeah, I thought it would be like... Uh, this is, might have been an early access game that got abandoned. Yeah, and at least these developers maybe then to stream please remove this. But I've seen some other games where they never remove the games. Okay, these like, monsters are that's... interesting, but I very much have to doubt that they are made by the developers themselves. Yeah. So yeah, th this, this game is a hard no on future streams. Yeah, there's nothing. Like, I feel like they, they started it with this to later. They make their own Starcraft later. Just needed some things to stop with. But, yeah, I feel like they never got away from that. Yeah, and, like, the birds aren't even moving their wings or anything. Yeah, th this has a. This has this big stink of uh, just getting assets from the store, slapping them together, and just uh, trying to get money from people out of, out of it. Again, I have no idea how I got my hands in this game. It might have been free, actually. Hmm. So, yeah, let's... Yeah, big nope. <clears throat> yeah, that is an awkward. And this was okay. removed. There have been a few bad early access games I've seen that has been on Steam for many damn years. The question: Why well, has it not been removed yet? Oh well. No, oh, that that is half the reason why we're doing this, just to check out games if they're worth a damn or not. As for these three, Mr. Shifty, Mutant Year Zero, 
Yeah. And nefarious, though, those are those are yes. We'll ha just have to see how long mutant ye mutant year zero might take, because yeah, yeah, it, it looks very interesting, but it would not be very fun if we were stuck with that game for like forty episodes. Yeah. So yes. For now, though. Uh, thank you for watching, Abby Missoni, and anyone else. And as always, special thanks to you, Dick here. You're most welcome, my friend. And yeah, shall we do just an extra stream tomorrow to see if we can finish Mr. Shifty so we don't have to put it on Saturday? Or shall we put it after we finish with Slime Ranch and start from the beginning again? Or maybe... Hmm... We, we've already gotten through about a third of the game, so I'm not sure if restarting would really be that big of a... Hmm. Yeah, I feel like maybe do it next Sunday for... It might just be one hour long. It might be even more, though, but... Yeah, I'll, I'll look up on the length of it. Yeah, it might be uh, good. Yeah. Yeah. We'll see. Maybe we'll stick it in the front next week. Uh... Maybe we'll, maybe if it turns out to be longer than we think, we'll just uh, put it, we'll just restart it after we're done with Slime Rancher. Yeah, otherwise it could be its own Sunday stream if it's only two hours. Yeah. For, for now, now though, though. Yeah. For now though, thank you again for watching and until next time, but until then, until then. Be safe, folks.